Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily preview for the 8th. But you know, this is just a preview, so it will resonate whenever it's meant to resonate. This reading may or may not be for you. It is not a sign specific, so it may or may not be for you. I do know that I have a bunch of mid-Julys left to do. Uh, like, I think I got five of them done, so I got seven left. I was going to do them today, but <laughs> my my son had other plans for me. And, yeah, so nothing got done today except for, you know, mama. <laughs> Mama's boy got taken care of. My mama's boy is 26. So, anyway... I do apologize. Those will get done ASAP. I promise. What do we have? What do we have for coming up? What do we got coming up? Ooh. Well, we got a loss of some sort here. Somebody has lost something big. They may have acted hastily. No fear. No fear whatsoever. High confidence. Now, the Knight of Swords and the Tower, they kind of have the same kind of energy in a way. This is like when lightning strikes and springs somebody into action. So somebody has been sprung into action. This is a loss of a friendship or a loss of a relationship. And this is a loss of something big. So hmm. there is some sort of loss here with this tower reversed as well. So hmm. hangman reversed. Interesting. Nothing to prove. Taking a new approach. We've got somebody here that is taking a new approach. Seeing things differently. Getting unstuck from a situation that has kept them... Lonely, isolated, confused. No more. No more. King of Cups reversed. Well, I will. Let me bring that down. This is somebody who is unemotional, cold, withdrawn, quiet. This is somebody who may not have good intentions. Somebody may have withdrawn from something, withdrawn from a, a friendship, you know, don't want to do it. Emperor. Nine of coins reversed, eight of coins reversed, not putting in effort. There's definitely a loss here. There could be a loss of finances as well. Somebody, you know, maybe losing out financially because of their hastiness. Maybe, you know, they acted in a bad way. They didn't care who they hurt. And now somebody has decided to definitely take action here. I don't need this. I don't need this false sense of security. I don't need this upheaval in my life. There's been a lot of upheaval. upheaval. We got somebody here who is standing strong. Really strong. got a better opportunity five of cups reversed if somebody is breaking free seriously with that hangman reverse it's like that no longer it's like turning their back on a disappointing situation turning their back on a depressing situation turning their back on 
Uh, well, there's definitely a loss, a loss of a, I mean, we get the three of cups reversed here and the three of cups reversed here. This is a loss of a friendship, a loss of a relationship. You know, there, there's no reunion. It's, there's no going back. There's no going back. Somebody has really found their strength. They faced a struggle. It's like this because the the hangman to become reversed. This this person has to deal with struggle. They have to deal with adversity to, you know, get unstuck. They have to look at things from that new perspective and take action to move in a new direction, you know, and face their the uncertainties. So it looks to me like we have somebody here that is turning their back on a disappointing situation because they realize that they got a better opportunity and the only way that they're going to get this better opportunity is to let go of the false sense of security they've been hanging on to because it was you know it was kind of comfortable but I don't think it was really that comfortable because if it was still that comfortable they wouldn't need to you know they wouldn't have felt isolated they wouldn't have felt confused they wouldn't have felt the need to prove themselves all the time you know they they wouldn't be in this predicament so it couldn't have been that comfortable um somebody was dealing with an individual who was definitely cold and withdrawn okay definitely um and they may have been cold and withdrawn because you know, they were looking in a different direction. I mean, the Three of Cups basically twice here. I mean, kind of, there could be a third party situation. Somebody could be coming to the realization, you don't complete me, I need to take action. There's, there's insecurities here. You know, we, fa we have somebody here that has been needing to find their discipline to let go of this false sense of security, and I think they found it. I think we have somebody here who has stepped into warrior mode. They have stepped into their own power. They have stepped into their own masculinity, or if it's a masculine, which I think it is. I think the emperor is a masculine. I, I really do. I mean, it could be a, f a feminine, but I, I don't know. I don't quite believe that. I don't believe that. Anyway, we have somebody here that is standing really, really strong. I think we have somebody that has made a decision to exit. They have made a decision to exit. They may have, and they may have, if you are the feminine, you have, may have made a decision to exit because you were being controlled. We have a very controlling individual here, very controlling, very manipulative, somebody that uses emotional blackmail as a tactic and does it quite well. So I feel as though we have somebody here that is just like, you know what, even though I don't quite want to go my own way only even though I may not have the funds to do so I'm going to do it anyway I'm going to I'm going to do it anyway I feel like somebody has made a decision and they're sticking to it um and it's an impulsive because the emperor and the knight of swords are both very impulsive it's like an a, a instant decision Somebody has made an instant decision, and maybe somebody has made made a decision to, you know, take control of a situation and get rid of a third party, and, or to get rid of somebody who's not contributing financially. You know, maybe maybe that's what we got here. Somebody has made a decision to withdraw. This person, you know, may be withdrawing from a relationship or a friendship because they're dealing with somebody who doesn't contribute. I mean, the Nine of Pentacles reversed, the Eight of Pentacles reversed, the Ace of Pentacles reversed. I mean, you know, if you're not contributing, then, you know, I need to face this struggle and let you go and look for somebody who's going to. There's a new prospect here. There's, there is. Somebody may, may just be beginning to realize there's got to be something better than this. So, I really feel like that's what we got here. Somebody comes to this awakening, they get their enlightenment, and they realize that, you know, <laughs> there's got to be something more solid, something better, something bigger, you know, than this, and I'm going to have to take charge here. We do have somebody who is taking charge. And it's like you can't, well, their mind is made up. dashed expectations seriously they may have expected this person to be solid to be stable but it, it really wasn't solid and stable okay 
So I feel like somebody has been holding on to that false sense of security, hoping things would change. But now they get this realization that this ain't going to change and this isn't what I want. Nine of Swords. Somebody has been really, really worried. They've been stressed. There's, but they've probably been in a state of depression. There's probably some regrets. There's some fears. Um... Totally, totally, totally exhausted. Totally. To the point of collapse. To the point where they can't barely function dealing with this false sense of security. Dealing with the false foundation that they were living in. Maybe somebody was living in their home and it just was <clears throat> too stressful. Maybe it was too stressful because, I mean, I don't see any love in these cards anywhere. Health issues. Somebody has had their health decline. Super, a big, huge amount of stress. Huge amount, which has caused somebody's health to decline Not only has it caused their health to decline, it may have caused their bank, bank, you know, account to decline, okay? Because we have a loss here, and it's a big one. It's a huge, huge, huge loss in more ways than one. So what do we have for the 8th? What's going on? I mean, it looks like we have somebody here that is about to really impulsively make a move, okay? This person may, just goes. It's like makes the decision and goes. There's no, I'm, I'm done, makes that decision to You definitely have somebody here that has made a decision and they're sticking to it. You can't stop this person no matter what you do. Um, this person is very intelligent. This person um, is very mature, wise. This is unhappiness. This person has made is, is heading, rushing. <sighs> I don't know if this person is, is rushing in for some reason. This is unhappiness. This is dashed expect expectations. The loss of a relationship. Dead end. This is a dead end. Lack of integrity. No growth, unhappiness, nothing to celebrate. Not going anywhere. Dealing with somebody who makes them very, very, very... It's like face this person. That's what it is. This person is going to face somebody. It's almost like fight, you know? I'm not saying fight, but, you know, communicate their truth, tell the truth, speak the truth about how unhappy they've been. So be prepared. Somebody may receive some, you know, somebody's opinion or somebody may, re you know, hear it all. You may hear it. You may hear the, you know, the truth from somebody. It could come out of the blue. All of a sudden this person, you know, <laughs> gets overwhelmed. Okay. Gets overwhelmed, gets overstressed. You know, maybe there's some sort of who knows what, maybe there's a, uh, a glitch in the bank account or something like that. I don't know what happens, but something happens and, Here it comes. Here, here comes the those words. 
those words that you have not wanted to hear, okay? So just be prepared. <laughs> um, yeah, this is an unhappy situation where I think that somebody is like, this is a dead end. It's not going anywhere. I have made a decision. I've done my investigation and I've come up with the conclusion that this is a dead end. And it looks like we have somebody here that has been living some sort of lie, deceiving themselves, probably really investigating, really observing, like I just said, and they have come up with their conclusion that this, there's this, there, that whoever it is that they're dealing with does not accept, uh, challenge this person does not follow through this person does not keep their promises this person um is they don't tr is distrustful this person uh there's got to be something better than this so i i i feel like we have somebody here that is making a drastic change the wheel of fortune a change in direction Faded change in direction. Whatever is happening is bringing somebody closer to where they are meant to go. But in order, this is the wheel of change, the wheel of fate. Change is on the horizon. Be, and this is to get something better. So it's going to, this is the, your lucky break. This is a lucky break. Something better is coming because somebody uses their free will. To spin that wheel. That's what we got here. And this is a good, this is, this is good. This is good. This is not fighting destiny. This is allowing. This is allowing the change of course. So somebody is changing their direction. And I think it's a probably, it's definitely meant to be. They're headed, somebody is headed in a new direction. And the truth is about to be delivered without tact. Get ready. Good luck. 